again, what is the lead game? What do we do for the lead game? Brianna. Making, make an interesting sentence to begin the story. To begin the story. It's that very first one. Very first line. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's going to go along with a happy dance maybe for tomorrow. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. It's it's happy happy dance dance so what do you get to write your lead sentence on? Snow And what am I going to give you to write your sentence on? A index card. Index card. Your index card. Is your sentence shared with your neighbor? No. no. This is completely on your own. Freeze. You need to come up with the best one sentence to start your story on. You want the rest of the classmates in here to pick your sentence, don't you? And if you continue on to write a story about it, it has to be interesting enough that you can create a narrative for your sentence. Take your time. Remember, touch read afterwards to make sure it makes sense. I'm going to read your sentence aloud as is. Woke up. I went outside. There was a huge snow zombie. I screamed, ah! not knowing what to do. And then something strange happened. That would be a good thing. That would be really good. Number two. All of a sudden, there was an explosion in the kitchen and all went down. Hill. Number three. Stop staring at me, Olaf. <laughs> Olaf. <laughs> Number four. So you're going to have to come up with a beginning, middle, and end of your story. Are all your stories going to be the same if it's talking about stop staring at me, Olaf? No. No, they're all going to be different, different which is really cool. Even though you're all going to start the 